Lucy Kelly, the food editor of Weight Watchers, is joining us again today. Thanks for being here. It's a pleasure, Justine. What are we cooking today? We're making veal stroganoff, which mm. is a really everyday favourite yeah. recipe that people love to make. We've just made a couple of little tweaks, little magic tricks that we use yep. to make it healthier. Well, let's get started. What can okay. I do for you? Well, first of all, I mix together a couple of teaspoons of paprika mm -hmm. with the veal. Yep. You can mix that I'll mix together. that for you. So what, are you using smoked paprika here? Or no, just regular, not hot, you, you just know nice what and mild. I love just, just standing here watching, I mean, this new concept that you have of still eating the way you want to, yes. just smaller amounts yeah. always makes a difference, doesn't it? Yeah, yeah. and we've still got generous portions. Yeah. You've got a lot more leaner meat, you've got your onions and lots and lots of mushrooms. Yeah, it's yeah. really just reducing the amount of fat and increasing the lean protein and the vegetables and you end up with a really satisfying meal. Yeah, you're not on lettuce leaves, I guess. Is that what everyone sometimes yeah. thinks that they don't going to eat lettuce leaves? No, and it's always good with any meal for dinner is to incorporate lots of vegetables. So for this meal, we would serve a, a, the veal stroganoff with the pasta and a big mm. salad. Yep. So I'm just going to brown off the rest of this veal mm -hmm. till it's nicely golden. Lovely. Not fully cooked through, because we'll finish cooking it at the end. Fantastic, and then we'll continue on. Yep. The smell of grilled onions. Oh, I know. You use hardly any oil and they're still getting that nice colour. It's great. They are. Mm. So next we're going to do the mushrooms. Yep, I can you do that for you. And I've got some garlic here, some lovely finely chopped garlic, as he's done for me. So then the mushrooms go in. So you just brown them, soften yeah. them a bit. And mushrooms are a really meaty vegetable, so they really do give that substance to a dish. how you put mushrooms in and they disappear. They so do. that's why we needed a lot of mushrooms in. That's right. Mm. So the next thing we do is put the veal back yep. in. Mm, and then this. we have a quarter of a cup of tomato paste. paste. Yep. So it gives that nice richness. Yes, yeah, beautiful. It really gives it that beautiful, strong tomato flavour. And we've got a tablespoon of Worcestershire sauce. And we've got three quarters of a cup of chicken stock. Chicken stock, OK. And then we're going to cook some pasta to mm. go with it. OK. We're going to have some fettuccine. Yes. And I always put salt in my water. Definitely salt. Because yeah. it does, the flavour goes into the pasta and it just, it does make it yummy. pinch. Mm. Yeah. And just give it a stir around until the water comes back to the boil and that just stops the pasta from sticking together. Yep. We'll turn that down so turn it's just down. simmering. Yep. And then it's almost ready. I mean, that it took is. about 15 minutes mm. to cook a really delicious yes. beef stroganoff. Easy, all right, well, we'll finish that off. I'm going to slice some chives for you yes. and then we're ready to plate up. How's the pasta, Luke? Pasta's cooked. Yeah. Nice and al dente. OK, I'll get a strainer for you. Thank you. Always undercook your pasta just a little yep. bit, because by the time you take it out of the pot and put it in your sauce, it'll be just perfect. Doing that so carefully. <laughs> I don't want it to end up all over the bench. <laughs> perfect, perfect. And then I'm going to finish off with the sour cream. I've turned the heat off. I think lower fat sour cream is not quite as stable, so it's important not to boil it. Ah, okay. But the heat of the whole stroganoff is just going to heat up the sour cream anyway. It doesn't need to be cooked anymore. OK. So we're just going to plate up. And this is just such a great family meal. The whole yeah. family can eat this. Yeah. Just because you're on Weight Watchers, you don't have to cook a separate meal for yourself. Everyone so can eat this. And I'm, look, I'm drooling right now. <laughs> Bit of that, bit of chives, bit of colour. Look at that. That's that's 
very nice. Yeah. Thank you That's very much. I'm looking forward to having a try of that. Yummy, have nice autumn winter Grab meal. Grab a fork. I'm going to have <laughs> one for you too. Yep. And maybe a little crack of pepper. A little crack of pepper, absolutely. Mm. Why not? Make that. Look at that. It's great. Thanks, Lucy. Fabulous. Thank you.